I am going to explain to you what Wave Launcher is. Please do. It's 99 cents on the market. All right, let me get my phone in view here. So when you first open up Wave Launcher, I'm going to show you where it's like if it's in your app drawer or whatever. Wave Launcher. This is insane. So I love this app. Yeah. You can edit your wave. When you get it, it's going to be all plus signs down there. <laughs> and then I haven't had a need for the calibrate yet. You know what this is like? This is exactly like the Wave Launcher on pre- yeah, that's, I think that's where they got it from. Uh, and then you can edit your wave. You can put whatever you want down there. I've chosen to use folders that are from another app. But when you're on your home screen, or it doesn't matter where you're at or what you're doing in this, you can be on. You can be playing uh, Robo Defense. And then while you're in there, you just love that game too. By the way, yeah. You can just pull it up, and then it came up because this is a landscape game. It just comes up, and then let's say I want to go, like this is my Android folder. I just hit that, pulls up my, uh, <laughs> pulls up my folder, and I can go to the market or whatever. Or let's say I got the shortcut for a press to end, so mm -hmm. it kills uh kills my applications. Nice. And let's see, got my messaging. I can go there, and then just switch to whatever I want, and then go from there, and go to. Go back to Robo Defense if I want, or I go to my multimedia. That really speeds things up. And go to Power Amp. So any anything anything I want, it just switches right back to it. Wow. And it's completely customizable, so you can put whatever whatever kind of shortcuts you want in there. It doesn't really matter. 